The following is a thermal image of a Gear 360 2017 model um, Samsung camera to analyze the overheating issue that seems to be kind of common with this new camera. On the left, you have a Gear 360 um, in a 76 degree ambient environment with basically no airflow going on around it. On the right, you have the same Gear 360 recorded at a later time, same ambient temperature, and this time there's an 80 millimeter computer fan um, pointed at it from about two feet away, giving it a nice gentle breeze. The Gear 360 on the left uh, is heating up much more quickly than the Gear 360 on the right, as you can see, and the Gear 360 on the left shuts down with the message gear 360 overheating at about 118 degrees Fahrenheit. The gear 360 on the right actually keeps recording continuously for an hour and 10 minutes before it was manually stopped uh, because the thermal imaging camera ran out of SD card space after about the 40 minute mark of recording. Otherwise, the Gear 360 on the right would have probably continued recording until the end of the battery life, which had got down to about 15% at that point. This uh, demonstration here, I think, shows clearly that the Gear 360 does not have uh, enough self-cooling built into it. It relies on ambient air movement. Whether this be outside on a hot sunny day with some ambient air, it will probably continue to record for a long time, or indoors with a fan, ceiling fan, some type of air circulation to keep this thing going.